So one on ones is the part of practice you're kind of oh, looking yeah. forward to the for most. For sure, for sure. I love one on ones. That's that's what the money is. I mean, you rush the pass and you get sacks. That, that's what the money is. is. Is it a technique thing for you? Is it a mental part of the game? What what what, what specifically were you working on heading into this week to show coaches what you want to show? Them? Right, just get more flexible. Um, the more flexible and the more uh, flexible you have, you bend more, you feel faster, you know, be more explosive out of your stances and stuff like that. So overall, it can help you out in a many uh, combination of different ways. But there's really no secret to to pass rushing. It's, it's it's one of those you have to work at it and it's either you got it or you don't. Thank you. Have a go. What's your ideal kind of playing weight, would you say? Where do you want to be at? Where, where do you feel best at when you're on the field? Uh, between 265 and 260. Um, I pretty much played that pretty much all year. Uh, right at like 263, what I weighed in the day. So uh, overall, it, it, that's that's how I feel good. I'm, I feel more explosive coming out of my stance. You know, I can set the edge when I need to. I can even drop down to 255 and still feel pretty good, um, which is what I did for the Missouri game. And felt more flexible, <laughs> felt faster in, in different aspects. So uh, it's really easy for me to change weights really quick. Talking about being flexible, is there a specific maybe scheme? Or, or position specifically, obviously, right. NFL defenses run a lot of different uh, right, right, right. Uh, options and schemes. No, yeah. for sure. I mean, I can fit in any scheme, honestly. I mean, I can go to 4 3 and put my hand in the dirt, you know. Uh, I can play 3 4 stand up outside, you know. I can do a lot of things. And then base defense, I go play Sam linebacker and do stuff like that, drop on the coverage. You know, I can do a lot of things. I've pretty much done it all in my college career with different defensive coordinators that I've been under um, in different defenses. Saying that, is there one that maybe would maximize what you think um, your skill set? So, perfect will. You got to pick one. Right. I would say uh, I like four down uh, most times because I can just just go, honestly, you know. Three, four is really good for me, too. I mean, I, I love both of them. Uh, but if I had to choose, I would say four down. But three down, I can definitely uh, come out of two-point stance or rush. You know, I can drop if I need to, uh, make quick movements on uh, tight ends, to get one-on-ones one -on -one with tight ends. So um, that's when I made my mismatches and made my money there. No doubt. Uh, you got a teammate here. Uh, Kai teammate. Polite came out. Yeah. Taven Bryan came out last week. What's been the secret sauce about you guys in this front seven, this Gators man, defense, we, man? We, we're dogs, man. That's 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 just that's just how you got to be. I mean, that, that mindset it, it does come easy. One one in the SEC and two being uh, the, being at University of Florida. I mean, we have that title that you have to just own up to. So um, having Jabari here, as well as guys on offense as well, you know, it just shows about the, the character and the guys that we're recruiting at Florida. And we still uphold that standard. You, you get to play with a couple of your teammates, as you mentioned. How tough is it to just get kind of thrown in the mix, though? Yeah. Knowing you're under the microscope, they want you to play fa fast, but you've never played with any of these right. guys. Right, but it's, at the end of the day, it's football. I mean, they, they kept the plan, the playbook pretty simple. I mean, there's nothing outrageous for us to be thinking too much. So all it is, you line up and go. So um, they did a really good job of helping us uh, understand that. You know, now we don't have – that's one less thing we have to worry about. It's a scheme. So all we do is line up and play. Is there uh, one specific dog in the NFL that you kind of mold or emulate your game? You like to watch? Yeah. You like to learn from? Yeah, I like uh, Khalil Mack. I mean, Khalil Mack and Von Miller, guys of those sorts. I mean, all the top-notch edge rusher guys, I love them. I and mean, they, they, they do things that – I mean, it's, people don't understand how difficult it is. Frank Clark as well how difficult it is to, to rush the pass and get there time after time after time after understanding that, you know, the guys are after you.